Welcome back to the Pokemon Legends RCS Countdown. So today on the countdown, I want to talk about Hisuian Zoark. Mainly because it's the only Pokemon I have left to talk about. And don't worry about that, I have plenty of other things to talk about, so we'll be good for the rest of the month. But Hisuian Zoark, obviously the evolution of Hisuian Zorua. Um, super, super cool looking. I really, really like this design. It reminds me of the Midnight version of uh, Lycanroc, which I have always been a big fan of. So this whole, like, werewolf aspect is really, really cool. Not saying that Zoroark didn't already kind of look like a werewolf, kind of, sort of. This one feels more werewolf-ish to me, which I'm really, really excited to see like what this would actually like tie into maybe in like design movement uh animation it's gonna be really cool to see so hasui zoark is the baneful fox pokemon uh and again it is a normal ghost from its uh hasui and zorua counterpart um and then we have its height at five three so it's it's actually decently short compared to like just regular humans you have someone who is normally 5'7", I think would be 5'7", 5'8", would be like the like typical like average height. So it's a little shorter than that. So, um, And of course it weighs 160 pounds. So it's literally just like a teenage human, I would say. It's like the same uh, dimensions and scale as that, which is interesting. So anyway, let's get into these uh, descriptions of Hisuian Zoark. Cursed illusions erupt forth from its voluminous coat. The spiteful power emitted from Isuian Zoark's long, writhing fur projects terrifying illusions, and it can also inflict physical harm upon foes. Damaging our bodies from both inside and out, the illusions that Baneful Fox Pokemon projects have expressions of such utter malice towards every last thing upon this world that those who see them are said to be driven mad by terror. You can see why it's called the Baneful Fox Pokemon. <laughs> Holy crap. This, like, that, that whole ending bit of it is insane. This thing hates everything besides its own kind utter malice towards every last thing upon this world that is insane like holy cow like it makes sense seeing like Zui and Zorua like ended up pretty much dying so it makes sense that this thing would be so hateful towards everything else because it's like yeah I don't want to you know I, I, everything has brought me to this point so oh my gosh dude baneful fox pokemon perfect category for it uh and then, <laughs> and then we have a pokemon with an unexpected soft side hisuian zoark is ferociously docile and aggressive towards people and other pokemon but it appears to have a compassionate streak for those it considers close or like family it has been seen to protect hisuian zora for example Anyone able to establish trust with a Hisuian Zoark would likely find it an invaluable ally. Interesting. So, like I said before, you know, it, it likes its own kind. I don't know if it necessarily shows in there that, like, does it like other Hisuian Zoarks? I would assume yes, but it could also be, like, kind of like a tribal matter to that as well, where, like, they're at war. Though they still like the Suing Zoruas because they're just younger versions of them. So, really, really interesting Pokemon. Um, Suing Zoruark, you know, I, I don't think I'm going to use this on my team personally. I think the second time around I probably will, but not like the first time around. I really like the werewolf feel to it, or werefox, I guess you can call that now. Uh, I really like that feel to it. The colors meld really, really well. Um, and it's just, it's a Pokemon that, like, I feel like needed something. Because, like, sure, it had its popularity in, like, Gen 5 and a little bit after then. 
but it kind of like died off and like went a little missing until like Gen 8 where it like randomly appeared in the uh what was it the Isle of Armor that you could catch uh Zorua in or no it was Crown Tundra I think so it's like it, it it's it's kind of cool that it's coming back and it's having its own little makeover with this very very interesting uh, choice of, of wording on their descriptions, which is just insane to me that it, that they would go that far uh, to say that this thing hates everything. <laughs> so it's really, really, really cool, uh, and I, I can't wait to see how this thing will play. <laughs> 